welcome to neutral side action, and we're just about ready for kickoff. And now the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Both teams have sent their special teams onto the field, and we're ready for the opening kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He's to the 20. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. Michigan's coaches admitted to us that they game plan around this guy. It's kind of different for a wide receiver. It's usually a running back or a quarterback, but he's paid off for him so far. He really has, and I, I found it very refreshing as we travel around the country and, and visit with so many of these players to find a high-profile wide receiver who's a selfless guy. He's a great leader from everything that they've told us. He's a guy that wants to go out there and make sure that the team gets the win first before he gets his catches. Kind of a rare breed in today's game of college football. Football, but he's an exceptional player. First guy on the field and the last guy off the track. He's got an opening. And they push him out at about the 49. And that was a nice pickup by the quarterback. Brad, I think this guy's amazing. He has an uncanny ability to scramble, and it showed right there on that play. From the 49-yard line, First down. Tackle at about the 43 yard line. That'll make it second and four. Throws a bullet over the middle. And he's tackled at the 30-yard line. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. First and 10, ball on the 30-yard line. Now he tries to buy some time. And he tackles him hard at the 17. From the 14-yard line, it's second down. Get to that quickly. Brought down at the one. This is the eighth play of this drive. Defense in their short yardage package. Touchdown, Wolverines! This is what an offensive lineman hopes for. An opportunity to impose his will on the defense. And he hits the PAT. An eight-play, 77-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. An amazing drive for this offense. Outstanding execution. If you're the defense, you've got to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of sync. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. Positive yardage. That makes it second and six. It's second down, six to go. Ball on their own 29. He's tackled around the 39-yard line. The reason why it's so crucial to be able to run effectively like this is it keeps the defense guessing. They have no idea whether you're passing or running, even if you need medium to long range yards. And it's caught. He gets rid of this one, and he's level at the 41. From their own 41 yard line, it's second down. That's 
That's a great tackle at the 43-yard line. at all, but just a good heads-up effort to get his fingertips on the ball. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. Little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. Not much of a problem getting the ball in the end zone on their last drive, as this quarterback just picked apart the defense. Well, I think this defense has got to do something because right now the quarterback is in such a good rhythm that you've got to do something to try to get him out of it. I would suggest trying to bring more pressure. Try to come up with an exotic blitz look to try to get him on his heels as opposed to being the aggressor and attacking the defense. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 21. Michigan is up a score. scramble they bring the quarterback down he just blew past the blockers and dragged the quarterback down boy excellent play by the defense here a few extra seconds and those receivers might have been open five wide Quickly. Score that round for the defense. These guys are flying around right now. The secondary decided to drop back into coverage here, and there was nobody open for the quarterback to deliver the ball to. Good job by the D. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. Tackle at the 47. This one might be coming back, folks. Let's check out the penalty. Receiving team. That one's going to put him way back. You just can't block a player from behind like that, or it's going to cost you. From their own 29-yard line, first down. He's taken down at the 43. I'll tell you what, this defense better start to get pressure on the quarterback. They're giving him way too much time back there to throw the football. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. And now he's got room to run, and they make the stop at the 45-yard line. Looks like we're going to have a good game on our hands after one. The Wolverines with a touchdown lead. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. is it wide open but it falls incomplete second down and 10 to go ball on the 45 yard line and he's taken down around the 37 yard line
They'll keep it on the ground again. And he is drilled at the 36. Looks like they're going to go for it on fourth down. Up the middle for a nice game. And this play is number eight on the drive. He's at the 20. Makes his way out to about the 15. From the 15-yard line, it's first down. A huge play, and now they're in a great position to score. Here's play number 10 on the drive. The tight end over the middle. Touchdown. Here comes the kicker to try to tie this game up. And he adds the extra point. Iowa ready to kick this one off. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. It's second and five here. Ball on the 30-yard line. And down he goes at about the 37 yard line. From their own 37 yard line. First down. Bring him down at the 46-yard line. Play fake, looking to run. Tackle at the 48. Got a first and ten. Ball on their own 48. He makes it out to maybe the 49-yard line. The Wolverines taking their first time out of the half. Toss across the middle. And he's tackled at about the 39 yard line. From the 39 yard line. First down. Now he's scrambling. Ball is loose. Bumble. Scoops up the loose ball. Right down around the 38 yard line. Close one there. Maybe the ball carrier will try a little harder to secure the ball next time. This is the ninth play of this drive. In the shotgun and five wideouts. Quick pass. And he hits him hard at the 28. 
It's first and ten. Ball on the 28-yard line. The Hawkeyes lineman coming off the field with an injury. He's a tough character down there, and I would imagine he's going to be back in this ball game before it's over. Not that impressive of a play. Let's see if they continue to employ the short passing game or if they decide to run the ball. This is the 11th play of this drive. Michigan's going to have to use their second time out of the half. Scrambling around. He dives, and he'll be marked down. He's got a touchdown. saw something upstairs it led to a touchdown you can thank the play calling there very impressive he makes the PAT a 12 play 75 yard drive and that's good for a touchdown the kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off excellent kick And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Fires quickly to the tight end. And he tackles him hard at the 32-yard line. The Hawkeyes will use their first time out of the half. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. He's tackled at the 39. So they'll pick up a first down there on a seven-yard completion. Nice protection, a good pass, and even a better catch. He can't ask for much more than that. Quick pass, man open, and he dropped it. It's second and ten. Ball on the 39. He gets sacked on the play. So the sack makes this third and very long. Quick strike to the receiver. He's taken down right around the 48-yard line. That was a good pass and catch there, but still not enough for the first down. That's not an easy conversion here on third down for the offense. All the defense has to do is stay back, keep everything in front of them, come up and make a tackle. He really got a hold of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback is on his way back onto the field, and he led a great drive last time out. Michigan is up seven. Takes the counter left. He makes his way to about the 28. We've got a great game here, folks, as we reach the end of the first half. 14-7, Wolverine. we played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Ball security was a major theme coming into this game, and both offensive coordinators have to be thrilled with the fact that their offenses, first and foremost, did a good job of taking care of the ball. And you don't see it every game, that's for sure, that both teams don't have a turnover at the half. And you usually see those critical mistakes that set up a short field for you to take advantage of. And, and it's definitely nice. It's nice to be able to put in a plan all throughout the week. 
and to be able to execute it and not to be able to make those big mistakes. Because coaches will tell you, it's those big mistakes that kill you. It's okay to be rushed in the pocket as a quarterback and then throw it to your mom in the third row. Don't throw it in harm's way. Both quarterbacks done a good job, and as a result, both teams with zero turnovers in the first half. That's going to do it at halftime, just about ready to start the second half. All right, you finish it up, brother. I'm going to get something in the cafeteria. I'm hungry. Wait, 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 don't leave until you get my order. Brad Kirk, take the second half. And we welcome you back to the action here, just about set for the second half. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. On the run, right side. Knocked out of bounds at the 32. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. And they get nice yardage on that run. First down. Fires out to his wideout. Tackle made at about the 45. That brings up second and nine. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Makes it out to maybe the 46-yard line. Nice run, and he's brought down. From the 48-yard line. It's first down. He's hit and taken down. Yard line. That's a gain of six on the play. That'll make it. This is the eighth play of this drive. And he carries the ball for a nice game. First and ten. Ball on the 21. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. You've got to admire the intensity that these linebackers bring to the table. As soon as he saw it was staying on the ground, he made a beeline for the ball carrier. This is the 10th play of this drive. third down here. Fires it out. What a play, and that is first and goal. That's a game of 13 on the way. That makes it first and goal. Here's the 12th play of the drive.
and they got him for a loss. It's second and goal. Ball on the 11-yard line. And they make the stop around the three-yard line. Here's play number 14 of this drive. They'll line up for the extra point in an attempt to tie the game. And he converts the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. You don't want to squander any possessions, but maybe now's the right time to dip into your bag of tricks a little. Think about some gadget plays to catch the defense napping. He's scrambling. Now he's going to run and watch out. Slides down to the ground. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Play action. Now he's on the move. He keeps it. That's a great tackle at the 38. That makes it so There's a player down. I'm not sure what happened. From the 38 yard line. First down. Well, as they take a look at that injury on the sideline, let's see what this backup can do at quarterback. Here's the throw to the fullback, and he's taken down at the 37. That brings up second and nine. Gonna go across the middle, caught, and down he goes at about the 33-yard line. So it's third down now, and they're gonna need about four. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. They'll bring him down at the 20-yard line. So at the end of three, 14 apiece. We played three quarters even. Fourth quarter is going to tell the difference. tries to buy some time. They bring the quarterback down. So that sack sets him back a little bit now. They're looking at second and 13. Here's the give. Tackled for a loss. There's nothing better than having an athletic, versatile, and instinctive safety. He makes a big-time play here with his recognition of the run, comes up and does what he does best, which is making a nice, short tackle on the ball carrier. Here's the eighth play of the series. Good protection. Fires it quickly. 
Finds a man again. And he shoved out of bounds at the seven. I like the call here. Looking for the big fella here on third down. They have a lot of faith in him as a receiver. Right there, he showed you why. First and goal, fourth quarter, all tied up. What's it going to be? Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Slides down. Here's play number 10 on the drive. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Touchdown, Wolverines. He hits the PAT. A nice 10 play, 74 yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was a textbook throw. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown play. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. Around the 46-yard line. He is such a good target, really anywhere on the field. But they like to get him the ball in short to medium range situations. From their own 46-yard line. First down. He has some room. He's at the 40. He gets hit out of bounds at the 30. That makes it first and 10. Around the 24-yard line. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Just under three to go in regulation. Now he's scrambling. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. Decides to slide. Huge play, and it's going to be first and goal. Well, we've got a player down, and let's hope that's nothing serious. So here we go. First and goal, and a field goal won't cut it. Touchdown, Hawkeyes. Will be tied with the extra point. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A six-play, 74-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Iowa gets set to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 20. Tackle at the 22-yard line. I think any good football team has to have an ability to answer. And that's exactly what we just saw. One team scores a touchdown. The other team comes right back and puts another touchdown on the board. This is getting exciting. You've got to be aware that capitalizing on this drive is crucial. You want to take the pressure off you and put it on your opponent. Catches it, and he's looking for more. Brought down at the 46-yard line. First 
and 10. Ball on their own 46. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Gets out to about the 48 yard line. Scrambling around. He's tackled at the 42. He airs it out. Touchdown saving tackle, but it leaves him with a first and goal. First and goal as they look to take the lead. Pushed out of bounds at the three-yard line. Touchdown, Michigan! Looks like they didn't get the playoff quick enough. Delay of game, offense. Under a minute left. He makes the PAT. Michigan lines up for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Black five, black five. He's got it out to his tight end. He's taken down at about the 29-yard line. Second and six. Ball on the 29-yard line. And he hits him hard at the 21. Oh, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman, when the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday on that one. He rifles it to the left. It falls incomplete. This might be their last chance. Fourth down. They'll need something really big here out of their quarterback on fourth and long. Throws it deep. Tackle made around the 37-yard line. Fires 
is incomplete. He was looking for the tight end. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. He wants it all. Rose, and he's got a man. Touchdown. The extra point to tie this game up. And he adds the extra point. Not much time left on the clock, and we've got a great one going. Tie ball game, locked at 28. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. He makes it out to maybe the 20-yard line. Kirk, right now, this is like a race, a foot race. And uh, I think the question is, who's going to get there first? How about watching these two quarterbacks execute their offenses? I mean, they're flawless up to this point. Great execution and playing with a ton of confidence. I think you're right. It's going to come down to that last possession. Late in the fourth quarter, tie football game. An important game for both these teams. And this is where you find out who your leaders are. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. And they make the stop at the 35. Boy, when you can rely on your tight end to move the chains, you've got a big-time advantage over any defense. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 35-yard line. Got it, but knocked out of bounds for a short loss. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. It's third down and 11 to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. Wants to go long and does. Well, that's just a huge stop right there here late in the fourth quarter in a game this tight. That might be one we look back on later and say that won the ball game. sure what the flag is about here. Let's go down to the field and find out. Receiving team. That penalty is declined. So it looks like four quarters wasn't enough. We're heading to overtime. And here we are. We played four quarters, and we still don't have a winner, so we go to overtime. They go with a screen here, and the halfback's got it. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. That'll be a loss of one. Not much going on there. Those kind of plays will not work against this defense. You can be sure of that. That'll bring up second and eleven. From the 26-yard line, second down. Rifles it right side, makes the grab and steps out right away. He 
He's going to try and scramble. Fumble. He picks it up. And he's taken down around the two-yard line. From the two-yard line. Second down. Touchdown, Wolverines. And he tacks on the extra point. down 10 yards to go ball on the 25 yard line there's a strike complete a huge play and now they're in a great position to score that makes it first and goal scrambled and he's going to run this one in touchdown they'll line up for the extra point in an attempt to tie the game and he converts the extra point both offenses did well responding to the early pressure of overtime now we'll see who can play better defense from the 25 yard line First down. He's got it with room to run. And they push him out around the seven-yard line. There's a play fake. And he's hit immediately. That'll be a gain of five. And it was a simple throw right back to the halfback who did a good job of getting some positive yards on the play. That brings up a second and goal. All on the two. Got to be careful of a pass play with this defense. And down he goes right around the two-yard line. And the fullback plows ahead for maybe a yard. The offensive line has got to do a better job of making space because that was just a punishing hit. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 25. Deep ball. Laying it out there. Oh, my. What a catch. Touchdown. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. And if two overtimes weren't enough, we are going to a third. And extra points are no longer allowed. If anyone scores a touchdown, they've got to go for two. Sets up a screen. Tailback's got it. Knocked out of bounds at the 24. Looks like the defense was in man coverage there, fellas, and that's why they stopped that screen. Yeah, and when the secondary isn't dropping back into zone, it makes it difficult to have success with that kind of screen play. 
and it's caught, and he's brought down quickly. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. Delivers to the halfback on the screen, and he's shoved out of bounds around the 16-yard line. Kicks up, and the field goal is good. It's first and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. Throws it out right to the running back. They'll bring him down at about the 27-yard line. Loss of about two. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. From the 27-yard line, it's second down. It complete over the middle. Good tackle there in space. Call it a gain of five yards. That makes it third and seven. And he's tackled at the six yard line. That makes it first and goal. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Tackle at the six. The running back gets a yard, maybe less. Tries to buy some time, and he's going to be sacked. a loss of six yards on the ball. That makes it third and goal. Third and goal for the lead. Little toss across the middle. Great throw, great catch, great game. The Wolverines, I'm sure, are secure in the knowledge that despite this setback today, they still have one of the best players in the country. Well, this is a devastating loss, but it's one that they're going to have to put behind them. And as you said, they still have one of the best players in the country. They don't need to deviate their plan. Get back to really what they know, and that's getting the ball to their star player. Next week, I'm sure they'll be fine. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.